Hi, I'm Katarisan Kumarisan. My employee number is uh, 019723, uh, working with uh, Finiza26 for seven years uh, with uh, zero record on my performance issue. For the last seven years, I'm getting my bonus. I'm getting my increment and I'm getting my share equity okay this is the first time after SF life came in as a program director you know I'm not getting my bonus on time uh, I didn't get my increment I didn't get my equity, share equities. Okay. Uh, my life is in miserable now. Okay. Hi Gary. Hi Elvin Lee. Hi Lizu. Thank you very much. I appreciate uh, that day you helped me to forward the message to HR folks. Hi Sheila Reha. Uh, hi Sheila Robert maybe I pronounce wrongly Shirley Reha right I'm sorry uh, this is Katir uh, the program manager for uh, 40G 100G SWDM and uh, recently I'm taking care of the 5G wireless product 3436 so I was taking care 3436 like um, halfway um, okay so I don't want to you know uh, discuss much on the uh, product or you know on the failure of the products I think everybody knows why uh, we're having so much issue on the product okay so that was uh, you know allegation on me saying that the product failed because of me i don't know how they put it they they looks like they're finding a scapegoat to put somebody there and penalize him for life all right so i'm the one so it's not an issue it's not a big deal for me okay i can handle the product very much i'm be doing this uh, you now program management from dvt from uh, even EVT, DVT, MVT, and RTP release to production. Okay, I have released so much of production the uh, last seven years I'm working. Okay, uh, I don't find an issue. Okay, to get this uh, close. Okay, um, well, Lizu, uh, Gary, Alvin, uh, I don't understand. <coughs> uh, they talk about my performance. And later they give me allegation on threaten and uh, you know misconduct I, I don't know how they define that maybe they define that my allegation on the threaten and the misconduct I'm not performing well maybe the way I threaten is the performance is not good I guess I don't know well it's for them going to find out, you know, what's the issue all about. Now the problem is, it's already three weeks. I don't see any feedback. I, I don't know the way they treat me like I murdered somebody in uh, Finiza 26. Okay, do you know how stressful I am? Do you know? You know, even though, you know, uh, the two weeks with half salary, and after September 24 they say full salary let me know let me tell you I'm not a beggar okay I should get paid for what I do the job that I do okay uh, I don't know I don't know honestly I don't know what's happening okay I feel like you know three people Dr. Siva the HR my boss as apply and yaps one see the vpmd okay they are sabotaging me okay it looks like a conspire okay 
they are trying to do something to me okay if I have a performance issue you should have issue or call me for discussion saying that Katir you got a performance issue we need to fix them I don't see anything I don't see any written email or written conversation or written okay there's no evidence even Dr. Siva came back to me and say hey, Katir I cannot find evidence you know on your performance I, I don't know then I said why then why you're holding my bonus okay then he talks about an option to me okay saying that Katir I'll release your bonus full bonus in December I said why in December this is FY20 performance why you're talking about FY21 okay he said that's the best option you can give me I said stop it if you want to help me please help me by putting my case to HR corporate where I really need help if Finiza Epo cannot solve my problem please take it up to corporate because I sent a mail to Swansea to have one-to-one -one discussion but she ignored me okay okay so I don't know what to say so the best way is for me to bring this to US corporate okay so I find I find myself is very stressful okay even though now from September 24 onwards they give me a full pay okay as I said I'm not a beggar okay I need to work for my money you know so it's 4 30 a.m. here I'm sitting outside the uh, you know somewhere Finiza I'm sitting here you know I'm in total stress I have sleepless night I don't know why they're holding my case for investigation so long they asked me 124 questions out of 124 109 is about my performance okay only 15 question on the allegation of threaten and misconduct okay so there's so many things happen okay SFLI was trying her very best to issue a warning letter this is this is the information I get on September 7 you know I got my bonus on September 6 where everybody got the bonus on 31st August I don't know why they hold I think you guys knows about it I don't know you guys already look at the investigation report of 124 questions they asked me I answered it very well to my knowledge okay then later they they are not giving increment for me they are not giving equity share they're doing all kind of things it's conspire it's very clear conspire and sabotage okay i think two six they don't do this when i look at the ethic conduct of work you know it's written by ceo chuck matra and another board of directors you know i saw the way he write there you know very professional they're expecting all employee to be honest professional and ethics okay and do with the right thing at you know they, they are telling that do the right thing okay and do it right okay so I don't know what went wrong on my performance how they value my performance okay anyway Gary I'm very stressful I don't know maybe tomorrow I'm no more who knows maybe you know with this kind of stressful life you know for last 20 years 25 years I'm not taking medicine zero medicine and today I'm on medical do you know how much medicine I'm taking all these are my medicines all these are my medicines okay? I have more medicines with me you know 
all these are my medicine now i'm starting to take on medicine okay. so much stress it's not my stress on my work okay but the people are doing you know some kind of artificial stress they're giving me some kind of artificial stress it's not a really a stress okay i've been working with bigger company than finisa i was working with selectron i was working with flextronic i was working with bcm you know but i don't know seven years was fantastic for me i feel it's fantastic i was very happy joyful with my job ever since sf came life go miserable not only me not only me there are still people in program management department are still in depressed do you know that or not they are still people you know they are vomiting okay they go on medical leave the way of how sf life treat them okay i have evidence i have evidence okay but until today finiza ipo is looking evidence for me almost three weeks they can't find evidence is it okay do you think i murder somebody or what they are looking for fingerprint okay they are maybe they can call the csi you know anyway gary lizu thank you very much lizu i really appreciate you are the man okay you are the man okay really helped me that night sheila you also helped me a, a lot okay anyway guys look into my case please look into my case please give me a fair deal if you think that i made a mistake point it out tell me kate this is your mistake okay even i spoke to my plm you know what situation i'm going to she was so surprised kate are you telling the truth you are going through this kind of situation i say yes okay anyway uh, gary i'm very depressed gary i'm very depressed okay but one thing i'm telling you if anything happened to me the person should be behind the bar i'm telling you behind the bar should be dr siva sfly and yap swansi okay i already made two police report okay what is going through in my life this is made i made in epo okay i made pull two police report one is what is happening to me right now in the office okay and all are in english you guys can read i made a special request to local police that i want to write in english okay the second report is basically on racist okay this is what happening in ipo finiza okay there's too much of racist they are firing malay guys they are firing indian guys they are hiring chinese it's totally a racist please look into it okay even i spoke to para ipo ministry department i spoke to them they are asking for me a report give me a report let them investigate what is going on okay but i i i didn't do that yet maybe maybe i i think this police can bring this report to ministry i don't know okay guys thanks a lot i miss you guys